Hi guys, this is Alex Andrezar and in today's video I'm going to show you how to change the door handle on the rear trunk lid of my W203. This is the rear door handle. The fact is that mine doesn't work anymore, it doesn't open the trunk anymore, so I have to change it. Uh, this is the part number and let's get cracking. Okay, because the, the trunk handle doesn't work anymore, car is open, we just have to open the rear door. And over here we have this handle, you just pull in it and you fold the first part of the rear uh, backrest. And then here's the second handle and you fold out the second part of the backrest. Right, I'll go closer over there and show you this little hole. Normally you have a clip, uh, this little hole over here. Normally you have a plastic cover over there. Mine was taken off and I'll proceed opening the door for there. Just like I've said, here you have this. You push it and it'll open. Now that we've opened the lid, it's time to take out these plastic retainers. Mine's have, mine has one missing over here. Uh, you have this one, this one, this one, this one. And of course, these three. If you got the stubborn one like this one is, put the prying tool over here and fish it out like that. Now, just have to pull upon it like this. and watch where those clips are. See one over there. Basically you get the gist. You pull on up until it will pop off. This is how it looks like on this side. Right, you see it? It's full of wax. I've waxed it before I've installed it. And this is how this one looks over here. You have one tab here, one tab here. You have two areas for inserting some weird clips. One tab here, another one here, and two on the bottom side. This can be changed and replaced if needed, if needed. Suppose you're having doubts about just changing the handle because, well, it doesn't work. Uh, you can test it very easily. So basically you just push this inside over here. And now I can't get it out anymore. Uh, let's manually open it from here. Push with this one. Okay, so now it's closed, right? Well, here's the micro switch, which should open the tailgate. And I'm trying to get best view and focus. Watch this. You 
see it works thing is this little critter over here works only when it wants to something has happened so we we will change it right now in order to take the handle off we need to take the bezel off this plastic bezel is being kept in place by a screw which is in the center of it and by a bunch of plastic tabs which are here and there that one and a few other ones so let's take off the license plate and unscrew the bezels Now exactly like I told you, this plastic bezel has this screw with a nut and a rubber grommet and also it's being kept in place by on the bottom side by one, two, three, four, on the top side one, two, three, four, in order to get this, these uh, plastic prongs out really easily in the hard to access areas basically that hole and that hole you take one bit five millimeter bit and press against the heads of them I think it's you can use a six millimeter or a seven millimeter probably works better because it will uh, it will collapse the plastic tabs really nicely so now we're just left with those two screws which need to be removed and we can replace the old door handle for the new one but in the meantime we remove this and detach this I'll do it off camera it's gonna be easier like I just said T30 screw Remove the old one and replace with the new one and screw back the screws in. Okay, I've replaced the old one with the new one. Perfect. Works like a charm. Now Time to screw them back in. You don't need to go crazy tight.
Basically, that's it. Reassembly is exactly the same as we've done the disassembly. This is Alexandre Zar. Thank you for watching. Hit the like, share, and subscribe buttons. Thank you very much, and have a good day.